Something that I've always wanted to do was build a truck with like big wheels, big tires, you know, the whole off-road thing. And I've never really done that. I've always, you know, done the Mustangs and the sports cars and stuff like that. But today, that's what we're going to be going to do is actually look and possibly buy uh, something that's going to be a little bit off-road worthy. And you guys know how I do. So it's got to be kind of a performance vehicle, if you will. So there's a couple options in mind, Raptors, Rangers, Tremors, this, that, and the other. But today we're going truck shopping. See if we can find something worthy of sitting next to our 2021 boosted Mach 1. And by the way, our new Harley Davidson that we're gonna be building on the channel. So we're gonna add another vehicle to the fleet possibly today, let's go. Guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. We're starting things out in the Mach 1 cockpit. And today is gonna to be a big one because we're going truck shopping. You know, we got the Booster Mach 1. If you guys are new to the channel, this is ESS Supercharged. We just pulled it down. We did a lethal performance fuel system and we're probably making 850 horsepower. I don't even know, but it feels freaking right. But we also just bought the 2022 Harley Davidson Lowrider S. Yeah, we're gonna be commencing on the bike build here ASAP. We got some companies on board that we're gonna be working with. I'm really excited to be able to bring you that content. Let me back up. I've always wanted to do like a performance truck build. You know, we have the street performance. Now we got two wheels again. Now I want a truck. I want another truck that we can play with. You know, something that's not gonna break the bank, but something that's gonna be special. I don't know if we're gonna do like a big truck F-150 or, you know, something smaller. So. Let's get up here to the dealership, take a look and see what they've got and see if we can make a decision or do we keep looking. I don't know if we're gonna buy something in this video or not, but I think it is time for a performance truck. We got the Mach 1 Mustang, we got the Harley Davidson, and now we need a truck that we can play with. But let's go shopping. All right, here, check it out. So, do we get one of those? Mavericks, the XL. That one's got a little bit more to it. I actually have inventory for this small dealership. That's pretty freaking crazy. The one by my house didn't have like nothing. It's all green labeled, special orders. Look at that. Dude, do we buy Bronco? Hold up, that might have to happen. That'd be sick. Um, okay, so lots of lots of choices here. It's cool to see a dealership actually with inventory. That's, uh, I haven't seen that in quite some time. Check it out. They've got a Tremor, a Ranger Tremor. That's freaking gorgeous. I like that. I like it. Lots of Mustangs, dude. They've got inventory. So many choices. Yeah, you guys know how shopping for cars is these, these days. I mean, it's it's not slim pickings, especially where I live. You can't find nothing. What's going on? Yeah. I saw the sticker. Yeah. 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 Uh, well, we're truck shopping. I got another Mach 1. Look at that, Velocity Blue. It's a 600A, 300 Carros that are cloth, manual. Very nice. And it's a handling package. Sick. An actual HP car. So, Velocity Blue. That's a four door, too. Yeah, this one was outfitted by Roush, so it's got a different exhaust on it, bit of a lift, wheels, really? tires. Really? Um, and it, it sounds really good. Sick, yeah, Roush. What's the price tag on this guy? Uh, this one, I think, is 64.9. 64.9. I do have this one as well. I think this one is right around 60. Okay. Um, or like 59, somewhere right there. I gotcha. But Eruption Green, they don't have many that are this color. It's a hard top, two more. Yeah, it's a new color. And Sasquatch package as well. Yep. All right. That's a manual. Interesting. And then you said you said you got the uh, the yellow? Yep. So I worked up in the rack. Oh, sick. Yeah, let's go check that out. Yeah, that one is a wild track, fully, fully loaded. Okay. Um, that one is price right around 75 I'm 75 okay they got some mavericks too those are hard to find yep. all right cyber orange two-door bronco with the hard top it's a v6 with the wild track let me know that looks pretty cool that is beefy he said it was like 75 all right 
So we got a Ranger, Tremor. To me, the running boards are probably a little bit low for like real off-roading. It'd be something you, but for, I mean, for light, you know, off-roader, I guess, they're probably fine, but wheels look good, tires look good. It's a good looking truck. Leather inside. Okay. Apple car play. Probably like the Mustang now. Yeah, we got the, the Alcantara. Leather and it does have the auxiliary switches up there, so if you end up putting a light bar on it or any accessories, you don't have to okay. mess with the wiring a whole Sick. lot. Sick! Oh my gosh, it's got a freaking key. It does have remote start from your phone, so but not from there. the fob either. No, Ford, yeah, what the heck? Girl looks good, so you want to drive it at all? Or? Yeah, yeah, we can take it for test drive, that'd be good. All right, guys, got the AC on blast this thing cooled off i've never driven a ranger before and this is the tremor edition so you guys know what they're all about you got the aux switches you can put lights and stuff on them you gotta actually turn the key kind of a throwback to i don't know the 1990s but <laughs> let's go for a ride so i've never driven a ranger before so let's see what it's all about all right guys we are in a ford ranger tremor which is the off-roady the more off-roady performance i guess version first time driving a ranger the um ranger raptor is not out yet supposedly coming to the u.s but maybe another year or so so should we buy this before that comes out I don't know. that's got some bad it does it's got all the safety features and everything that we're used to they come loaded up. The, the Tremor's got pretty much everything, right? Mm -hmm. Unless you got like Larry, I guess you get a little bit more. This is the next LT trim. You definitely feel the tires. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Little turbo. <laughs> 2.3 EcoBoost. Uh, very similar to the one found in the EcoBoost Mustang. It's got the lane assist, but uh, if you're anything like me, you'll probably never use that. Never. <laughs> up and that stuff gets turned off all right guys so yep tremor this is an option or you guys saw like the, they had the broncos i'm sure you guys got some f-150s and uh pretty cool that you actually I, you had a uh, another mach 1 in there on the showroom mm -hmm. so pretty good inventory here at uh beaming forward mm -hmm. and um anyway so appreciate jp over here put your camera um helping me out and some of the decision making so should we do this i really like i've always liked the small trucks with like you know big wheels and tires and stuff like that. i've always wanted to do that so with an f-150 we're just i don't know if that would be the, the right vehicle this might have to be it or like the broncos already kind of come that way but i don't know this is pretty cool so i think if we're gonna get a ranger definitely get this one um or maybe a bronco or i i don't want to sound People are going to kill me in the comments when I say this. I kind of want to check out the Maverick and see what that's all about, too. Just to look at the inside, you know what I mean? <laughs> the, the, anyway, anyway, so, all right, we'll finish up our test drive and uh, get back and see what's up.